monster of Piedras Blancas. The monster of Piedras Blancas. The world's most shocking monster. Stalks its unsuspecting prey. Feasts its eyes on the next victim to writhe in its slimy arc. The screen's most nightmarish beast. A claw-fingered, scaly-skinned, half-human crustacean turning a lonely lighthouse village into a frenzied bedlam of blood-curdling horror. Never have you known such cringing terror, such sudden shocks. there are things better left unsolved. Who knows what waits for us in nature's no man's land? Impossible, unbelievable, fantastic. But I tell you, it could happen. It could happen. It could happen. It could happen. Yes, it could happen. For various authorities believe that buried somewhere under the polar ice cap, in a state of suspended animation, are the awesome creatures, the leviathans that roamed the earth at the dawn of time. And under certain conditions, a nuclear explosion could free one from his icy tomb. Then, guided by instinct, the beast would come back, back to the caverns of the deepest Atlantic where it was spawned, an armored giant wreaking his prehistoric fury on modern man and his puny machines. Cities would be terrorized by the cruel intruder from the past. Populations crazed and panicked with fear by its destructive force. Granite and steel would crumble. Soldiers and their weapons would be powerless before the onslaught of the beast. The beast. The beast. The beast from 20,000 fathoms. Herald Square, 34th Street. Broadway, every section of the city is guarded. No one knows where the monster will strike next. <laughs>